Welcome to Outdoors for Adventure. In this video, I'm going to show you the Feewood Gear SUV awning set up on the Jeep Grand Cherokee. This is a very nice, spacious SUV tent awning. There's several different ways you can set it up. I have another video on the channel with me setting it up in various styles. So be sure to check that out. I'll have a link in the description. Show you exactly how to set it up, what all comes with it. But I wanted to do just a quick walk around with it set up. Catching that wind, keeping you cool, keeping you out of the sun, and looking good. Check out the description for a link to the Feewood Gear tent and save some money. Hey guys, we're going to put the Speedwood gear awning on the Jeep Cherokee Trailhawk. They got a special sale going on these. Check the description for the links. Big, nice, heavy poles. I think I'm only gonna need one this trip. I'm just gonna do it V tent style. So I use these Velcro straps just to strap them to the top of my rack.
Now we do the other one. These straps go on the wheel, or you can just take them to the ground. Just like so. I don't need to stay. Probably something for camera here. I'll bring the hand. Come off of here. Yes. Like I said, this thing has some real estate. I just want to go to the ground with this one. I don't need a lot of space. Just pure.
same fist onto the ground. I like how sturdy their straps and stuff are. There's a tree kind of away. Now, if you don't have a rack on your roof, there's suction cups that come with the kit. So you can suction cup that part up there. I'll do the side thing. I don't need this corner strap since the stake's going to the ground. These are the suction hooks that come with the kit. So if you need to stick it to your vehicle, instead of using the Velcro straps, you can. All right, that's set up. Let me move you off so you can look better here. Okay, so there is the fee wood awning for your vehicle a lot of real estate there doesn't take too long to set it up like I said they're fixing to have a sale on this and I'll have a link in the description where you can go pick you up one of these for your adventures and save some money it's very nicely made. I go around this tree. Stakes and tighteners that are provided with the straps. And you get two of these heavy poles. So you can put one, you can spread them out, put one there and one there, and you'll have more headspace. And I have another video where I went in really good detail about this tent and set it up several different ways. I'll put a link in the description for that video. But yeah, uh, you're pretty much protected up in here. You know, I've set up, once I pull that out and lay that side seat down, I can sleep up in the vehicle. Leave my fridge and all that in there. And I have my chairs that I'm fixing to set up. Stay tuned for that because I've got three... Uh, Dear family chairs, I'm fixing to set up and do a little video on. But this video is about this tent. It's one of the best ones like this I've seen. I have a couple of the 
actual tents that you zip up the screen over the hatch and stuff and they're pretty cool but if you're wanting to camp and you need space out of your vehicle this has all that space and if i was gonna climb up there and sleep i would probably if the bugs are bad i'm just gonna shut the hatch i have screens that go over the windows and a screen that goes over my sunroof so i can open that up and those will keep the bugs out yet i'll still have plenty of air Like I said, be sure to check my other video out. I shared the link in that video too.